Hey everyone and welcome to the stream. My name is Patrick with the Boulevard Bullies and it's actually St. Patrick's Day. And today is the day that WWE 2K23 came out. We're going to be going through the John Cena Showcase. Match by match, step by step, piece by piece. Don't try this at home. Oh no. Am I about to get demonetized? Oh no. We gotta put it into like safe streamer mode. My name is Xavier Woods. Oh my God. All right, take me to the tutorial. Anything to stop this Red Hot Chili Peppers music. Welcome to WWE 2K23. Why are his tattoos blurred out? time in the virtual squared circle, they're not. You're in good hands, Look at this, his tattoos are blurred out. What kind of jeans are those also? His name is John Cena. Do, 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 do. As we all know, John Cena is a living legend in this industry. When I found out John was being featured in the WWE 2K23 showcase mode, I knew I had to find a way to be a part of it somehow. Because for I'm sure years, you did. As of right now, this is my showcase chapter. You are gonna help me train for a dream match. John Cena versus Xavier Woods on the grandest stage of them all. Welcome to the Performance Center. After each lesson, you will complete objectives in the ring. After the objectives, it will be time for our dream match. What are we learning? Fundamentals. Why? To beat John Cena at WrestleMania. When? Now. Now. All right, so let's do the tutorial here. I don't even know what the buttons are. Gameplay basics, Superstar HUD. The gameplay HUD at the bottom of the screen shows information about a superstar's vitality, special media, paybacks, Special meter, paybacks, finishers, and limb damage. Let's discuss vitality first. Then we'll cover the rest during our training. I hate how you have to hold X. Why can't you just tap it? Attack damage lowers vitality, and a low core vitality means a superstar is more likely to be successfully pinned or submitted. To recover vitality, avoid getting hit. No shit. Class is now in session. Light attacks are box, and heavy attacks are X. Grabs are circle, or used to set up grapple moves. After initiating a grab, press box for a light grapple, press X for heavy, and press circle to Irish whip. More about whips later. Practice hitting light, heavy, and grab attacks on Corbin. <laughs> I don't want a mini game to get out of a submission or a pin. Like my mini game is smash the button. I don't want any bar to fill up or something like that. Grabs can be used to set up drags and Irish whips. All right, all right. So we already did that. Let's do a heavy attack. Oh, Harlem sidekick. Oh, Russian leg sweep. All right, we did it. We won, we beat the game. We're ready to face John Cena. Basic offense, combos. Perform combos against standing opponents using light, heavy, and grab attacks. First hit a light attack, also called a combo opener. The final hit, a combo ender, identifies the combo type. If the final input is circle, it's a grab combo. The inputs between a combo's opener and ender will always be light or heavy attacks. So it's always box, and it usually ends in circle, but in between it's box or X. Poor Corbin, right? It's like, hey, Corbin, we're putting you in the game this year. You're the guy Xavier Woods beats up. Wow, this is like super complicated. Each superstar has three combo trees, towards, away, and neutral. Now let's see you hit Corbin with a towards light combo, away heavy combo, and a neutral grab combo. You can find the complete lists in the combos section of a pause menu. I've seen some of you play box, online. Box, so this part box, is box. Check your All right, combo cool. inputs neutral. in the pause menu. Box, X, circle. Hell yeah, all right. Um, now box XX, okay. Here we go, here we go. Uh, XX. Oh, I fucked it up. Oh! That was cool. Hell yeah. Can we go up top? Oh. Watching you deliver knuckle sandwiches to Corbin never gets old. Attack is important, but also is avoiding damage. Let's learn basic defenses, starting with reversals. Reversals are the first line of defense from attacks performed by pressing triangle when the overhead prompt appears. When timed correctly, triangle will flash. In this objective, Corbin will be trying to get some offense in. Don't let him. hi Flying cross body block. All right, try to hit me, Corbin. <laughs> you suck. Ha! You're a natural. Let's learn more defensive techniques like blocks and dodges. What, what do we? What is this Mortal Kombat here, bro? They probably went up to Corbin and said, "We are sorry." 
Yo, I don't think Corbin cares. He just likes cooking his Dodges meats. Depend on the weight of a superstar. Puck, dodge, reverse, break. Deep oh, jeez. Not get hit. All a right, lot hold things. triangle to block. Come on. All right, we're blocking. Oh, now we can dodge. Oh, wow, that's cool. Great job. Let's finish up basic defense with combo breakers and grab breakers. Oh, Jesus. Basic defense breakers. Brawn breakers. If you miss the reversal window on a combo opener, you can attempt a combo breaker by pressing box, X, or circle at the same time as your opponent. If you guess incorrectly, you won't be able to try another breaker for the rest of the combo. Uh, that, that doesn't make any sense to me. Grab breakers work in the same way. So a combo breaker. So like, so if the guy's doing uh, any combination of box. So, okay. If you miss the reversal window on a combo opener, which means that triangle will flash and will try to block the, f like reverse the first strike. You can attempt a combo breaker if you miss that by trying to match the second button or third button, I guess, that the person is pressing. So if it's box, box, X, you can try to match the button and fucking uh, do it. But if not, you can't try it for the rest of the combo. All right, let's see if we could break this combo. Look out for any incoming oh, offense, then attack. Back. Okay, well, that Breakers didn't work. Challenging. Keep practicing. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we're just trying it with box. We're going to let him hit us first. And then we're just trying to hit box. All right, so this is fine. Who's that guy? Is that Drew Gulak? Way to get after it. When there are multiple superstars in a match, you can switch focus using targeting. To target a superstar, lean in their direction during an attack. Or you could cycle through multiple targets by pressing right stick. Changing your target will show an arrow. Oh, thank you for the arrow. Facing the target under your superstar's feet. Okay, let's, uh, we may need a volunteer. Hey, it's Drew Gulak! Drew Gulak's in the house. Drew happens to be a self-proclaimed expert at training WWE superstars. After he enters the ring, practice targeting and attacking Gulak and Corbin. All right, so let's try the lean method first. Wait, has Gulak been here the whole time? Use targeting, then go for the attack. In a pinch, okay. just attack to change targets. How does anyone target Cena if you can't see him? <laughs> oh, wow, and you can actually just hit right stick to do stuff, too. Okay. So that, that works. You just click it once and it cycles through. I can tell you're locked in. Now it's a good time to learn about Irish whips on St. Patrick's Day. John Cena. <laughs> An Irish whip sends an opponent running to your chosen location, such as rebounding off the ropes or the corner of the ring. Standard Irishes are performed with a grapple circle, leaning left in the intended direction and pressing circle again to execute. More powerful the Irish whip... Hammer throw is performed by holding instead of tapping. Okay, cool. Time to practice Irish whip, blah, blah, blah. Strong Irish whip to Drew Kulak to gently throw him out of the ring. Yeah! Get over here, ghoulie. Yeah! Oh, shit. Wrong, wrong thing. Wrong thing. Over this way, ghoulie. Hammer throw! Whee! I did it. How do you taunt? Thanks again to Drew Gulak for stopping by before his flight out. Let's dive in on how to methodically wear down an opponent with submissions, limb targeting, and limb damage. Does it feel much different than the last one you played, or you haven't played enough yet? I haven't played enough of the other ones. The last one I played was, let's see, I just I just saw it. It's like, I, I think the last one I had was 2013? 2017 was the last one I did. And 2016 was the one that you did Stone Cold. Uh, they did a Stone Cold spotlight. So I haven't played this in five years. Thanks for taking a look behind the scenes with me. When the minigame appears, repeatedly press box, X, or circle to fill the meter to make the opponent tap out. When they fill the meter first, if they fill the meter first, the hold will be broken. Uh, in a standard rules match, making the opponent tap is as good as a pin. What was it? R2 in circle. Put down the opponent with submission holds. Some superstars are masters at applying or escaping huh. holds. Okay, that didn't work. Limb damage. Ow. God damn it, Corbin. Yeah. Submission. Single leg crab. 
eat that, Baron Corbin. If that is your real name, circle, circle, circle. X, 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 X. Oh, good. You know, it wouldn't be a wrestling game if there wasn't button mashing. I know that that was a little bit of a mini game. You have to change your buttons, but there was mashing. So that's good. I hope that kicking out of the pin can be mashing as well. Nice. You made Corbin tap out. Let's learn more about limb damage and limb targeting. You can double down on damaging a specific body part by using limb targeting. To target a limb, press circle to grab, followed by a light attack box while standing near the head, armed, or... To target a limb, press circle to grab, followed by a light attack. What? You may have no... Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. You may have noticed a silhouette in the Superstar HUD. This is the tar this is for tracking limb damage. Each stage is colored by severity of yellow, orange, then red. The more damage the limb becomes, blah, 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 the more effective the submissions to that area will be. Wow. Let's break his arm. Repeatedly attack one of Corbin's head, body, arms, or legs. <laughs> That's a funny, that's a really funny sentence. Repeatedly attack one of Baron Corbin's head, body, arms, or legs. I forgot, what was it? Grab and then hit. Box or X. Okay, so let's grab and then hit X. Follow limb damage status. Boom. Keep my All right, we're doing that. How about this? How about it. box? Oh, this is a classic one. We're working the knees. We're working the legs. Oh, whoops, we just did a submission. How do you cancel a left left bumper, left L1? Um, hold on, let's let's hurt your knee more. Oh, this is a good one. Oh, these are all classic wrestling leg hurting maneuvers. Ha! And I figured out how to taunt. It's the D-pad. Poor Corbin. <laughs> Looks like someone's almost ready for WrestleMania. The blue special meter in the Superstar HUD allows you to perform quick get-ups, paybacks, or even special moves like signatures. I burnt my tongue. So it's a little hard, um, my, a little bit of a swollen tongue. When you are in the proper position to perform a move that uses special, the HUD will also highlight the amount of special that the move costs. Quick get-ups, R1, allow a superstar to spend one special thing to get out of a jam. Or no, to spend special. So I guess it's more of a bar than a, like, ticker. For instance, instant recovery immediately returns a down superstar to a standing position. Just he doesn't even, it's not even a get-up animation. It just goes, boop. There's no, like, getting up animation. It's just, like, it glitches him back standing up. That would be awesome. Ring escape allows you to roll out of the ring, but requires being close to the ropes to use. Ring escape. Let's beat the shit out of a man's leg. Paybacks R2 plus triangle allow you to spend a special meter to perform an ability that turns the tides on the opponent. The payback HUD icon will light up when you earn one. Special move signatures. Uh, each signature has requirements for attacker and defender's positioning before the move can be performed. If you ever forget, you can check the moves tabs in the pause menu. To hit my signature, get Corbin on the ground and stand in a distant corner, then press R2 and box when the signature prompt applies. I will. Prompts appear when signatures ha. and finishers can be performed. Signature moves are often used to set up a finisher. Yeah, no shit. Whoa! What kind of move is that? All right, far away corner, far away corner, far away corner. Ha! We're doing it. We're doing it. I don't oh, even know what is. Day. New day. And there he goes. Wow. <laughs> Let's do the finisher. Ah. Uh, take that, Corbin. Finishers are the most powerful move in a superstar's move set and appear as a yellow finisher segment stock in the superstar HUD. Pro tip, if you reverse a superstar's finish, er, you will steal their finisher stock too. Small package driver, diving elbow drop. Well, we gotta go for the diving elbow drop. Like signatures, a prompt will appear when a finisher can be spent. I already Ready pressed- see something cool? Hit my finisher. And then you can turn it into a pin. Oh, that's an awesome move. So I guess you like hold the right stick when you're prompted to turn it into like a pinning attempt to maneuver. That's what I'm talking about. Now that's Corbin's down from taking a finisher. It's a perfect opportunity to try a pin. I'm like fucking the game up. To attempt a pin, flick right stick down when your opponent is on the map. In standard match rules, avoid pinning a superstar when they're too close to the ropes to drag them, press circle to grab them, and then press L1 while leaning towards the direction you want to go. Oh my god. Go for the pin while he's on the map. 
Oh, I already beat him. <laughs> I fucking glitched the tutorial. It's almost time to get into our ring gear, but what happens if you get pinned? When a superstar tries to pin you, you need to compete in a mini game to kick it out. Uh, ooh, offers two mini games, rapid button mash and timed meter. Dude, we're definitely choosing button mash. Kick out of the rapid mini game by repeatedly pressing X before the referee finishes the three count. That's how we do it. The exact amount of presses need to fill the meter. Press the button Ooh, repeatedly that's... to kick out. Pin me, Corbin. One. Ah, that felt good. The mashing. The mashing feels good. Look up in the kick out zone, blah, 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 blah. You've completed the final chapter of the tutorial. Congratulations on all you've learned today. I know you will do great at WrestleMania. Let's get this dub ya. Wait, one last thing. It's time to choose which pin mini game you want to use. Oh, we're definitely going for MASH. Rapid, baby. We want Cena. We want Cena. He's chanting, we want Cena. Oh my God, we just completed the tutorial. Now we're at WrestleMania. Here I am. Put on your smiles and eat your positivity up because here comes Xavier Woods. Hi, Boulevard Bullies here. We're playing 2K23. This is the final stage of the tutorial here. Basically, you play as Xavier Woods, beating up Aaron Corbin in the performance center, learning all the moves, and then you finally fight John Cena at WrestleMania. Using all you've learned. From Atlanta, Georgia, in at so here's five pounds. Xavier, Xavier Woods doing his WrestleMania the walk, his little dance, with the new day. Uh, Multiple time uh, matches. They even shaking his little butt, <laughs> playing his little yeah, trombone. Is Woods is not competing alongside Kofi and Big E tonight. It's an entirely different challenge at the showcase of Immortal. Great entrance. But I guarantee you that Woods is more than ready for the challenge. So this is going to be the first time we see John Cena's entrance in the game. Pretty exciting. Pretty exciting stuff. At WrestleMania, the showcase of the Immortals. The greatest of all time, John Cena. And his opponent, from West Newberry, Massachusetts, playing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! Big Matt John is back where he belongs at the showcase of Immortals. Good stuff, John. He competed for the WWE Championship in seven consecutive WrestleManias. Since then, Cena has had epic clashes. Do, 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 do. This is like before John Cena got the hair he has now, but when he had his hair longer than the classic buzz cut Cena. It was a weird time for Cena's hair. I'm going to use what I've learned, John. Ha! What limb should we target? His brain. Yeah! Ah. We're killing it. Top rope time! Oh! We kind of still got him. Submission! John Cena, you will submit to my octopus stretch. Uh-oh. Oh, he broke it. Oh, sidewalk slam by Cena. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. High back body drop. Oh. Oh, we kipped up. Oh, no. Oh, he's going with a bear hug. Yeah, you got to give the dramatic elbows. Oh, and the clap. Ringing his ears. Escaping the bear hug. Oh, that was dope. That was a running grapple. Easier said than done, gentlemen. Ooh. All right, we're going to we're going to try to hurt his head. Oh my, discus punch. We're going to work the head. Oh. Uh, fucked him up. Oh, look, he's getting up in the corner. That's so cool. Oh, he got up right away. No, John, no. Come 
Come on, jump. Oh, jeez. Come on. It's a good match. Pretty good match so far. Let's throw him outside. Let's throw him on the apron. All right, now we got to grapple with him, and we'll do a weak grapple. Oh, that was dope. How do you jump off? Can you do a, can I do a dive? Yeah! Let's throw him into the stairs. I hope we get these desks at a discount. Oh, fuck you, John. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. Yeah, as Woods knows how to use the fact that his opponent... Can I walk up the stairs? Him again. I need to walk up these stairs. Oh, ooh, we walked over them. Woods is thinking big here. How do you get down? Right now. Get down. We could have been looking at a count out there. Yeah, you just know that would have been a deflating result for the Dodgers. Oh! oh no, I think that one busted up Cena's face. We busted him open! Oh, jeez. Oh, no! John, no! Oh, my God. He almost gave us the fucking five knuckle shuffle. Oh, that was so dope. Cena is unable to stop this string of offense. Yeah, Woods is appearing unstoppable. We're unstoppable. We're like Brock Lesnar Woods. And he sends him into the okay, corner. I think, yep, okay, so you here. hit up. And now circle. This game's about winning at any and all costs. And maybe bot. No, this just circle. Knows exactly what they want to do. Push on the top row. Superplex, baby. We're doing a, We're doing the charge finisher. We're fucking kicking his ass. Oh, we reversed our finisher. He's coming back. He's John Cena. We beat him. We beat John Cena, everybody. Hell yeah. <laughs> I beat the game. Speed run. <laughs>